Body blow to thousands of farmers. That is what the American Farm Bureau calls the latest news in President Trump's ongoing trade war with China. Thank you for joining us tonight. I'm Matt Templeman. Renee McCullough is off tonight. With China halting exports of U.S. agricultural goods, KZI 9 News reporter Chris Lewinberg shows us what farmers are saying here at home. Uncertainty is in the air in farming communities across the United States. Here in Oregon, China is one of the top four international markets for agricultural goods. And despite the risks, one farmer we spoke to is optimistic about how the trade war will play out. $290 million in Oregon agricultural exports went to China in 2017. Compared to the $1.8 billion total dollars in ag exports from 2018, it may not seem like that big of a chunk. But experts at the Oregon Farm Bureau tell us the lack of access to Chinese markets could seriously impact farmers. About 40% of Oregon's crops are exported internationally, and China is among the top four importers. While the immediate future remains uncertain, some farmers feel the president's actions will help out in the long run. I'm happy to see that uh, President Trump is finally taking on a problem that everybody since President Nixon's probably talked about. And I think it might make things in the end easier actually to get feed into China than it is now. Other farmers we spoke to asked not to go on camera, but were worried that the short-term impacts would be too much to handle. Experts tell us that impacts from the trade war could be delayed, hitting farmers after the fact. We'll hear more from those experts coming up at 6, but for now, reporting in Coburg, I'm Chris Lewinberg, KZI 9 News. And now to the app.